What's up everyone and welcome back to Movie Rays. The infamous actress from one of the most well-known franchises ever, Narnia, had no idea what she was auditioning for back when she got cast as Lucy. This is not as shocking once you find out how young she was when filming these movies. Let's go through every detail regarding Georgie Henley's career, shall we? The Chronicles of Narnia Video Game Georgina Helen Henley was born July 9, 1995 in Ilkley, Bradford, West Yorkshire, England. She is the youngest of three daughters of Mike and Helen Henley. Netflix's new Chronicles of Narnia reboot, which is currently in development, woke up the feeling of nostalgia in us. The sad truth is that we will not see the already familiar Narnia cast in this reboot. The young actress's first role was for a Narnia video game that was released prior to the first film of the franchise in 2005. In it, she lent her voice to the character called Lucy. The Chronicles of Narnia The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe Henley made her acting debut as Lucy Pevensey in the first film of the popular Disney franchise, which is also the most successful one. Based on the C.S. Lewis's novel, The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe follows the story of four children trapped in a magical land called Narnia. And well, the rest is history. Georgie played the sweet Lucy, the youngest of the Pevensey siblings. She was only eight years old when she got cast for the project. Luckily, with Narnia, I was so young that but I wasn't really thinking about it. If I would have gotten the role of Lucy now, I would definitely be more worried," Georgie said in an interview with Anarnia's Web. When the creators needed to find an older version of Lucy, they've come up with a brilliant idea. Georgie's sister, Rachel Henley, is also an actress, so the creators decided to cast her for the part of the older version of the character. So bad. There's ice skating and snowball fights. Jane Eyre Just one year after the premiere of The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe, Henley was cast as young Jane Eyre in the TV miniseries Jane Eyre. The young actress appeared alongside Ruth Wilson and Toby Stevens in a story where Jane falls in love with her master. Directed by Susanna White, the show was praised by both fans and critics. The Chronicles of Narnia Prince Caspian Two years after the premiere of the first film, Narnia Prince Caspian was released, with Henley reprising her role as Lucy. Before joining the franchise, Georgie acted in a local drama group called Upstagers. She appeared in several stage performances, including Babushka, A Christmas Story, and The Pied Paper. But this was before she got her breakthrough role. The casting director for The Lion, The Witch, and The Wardrobe, Pippa Hall, was in Georgie's town while looking for actors who would fit the portrayal of the four Pavensi's children. And once she saw Georgie, she knew she was the one for the role of Lucy. Although it took Georgie a single audition to get cast, the directors made their final decision after 18 months of auditioning. And out of thousands and thousands of kids who went to audition, Henley was finally given a call to star in the first Narnia film. You see, the actress was only eight years old when she appeared in the film, and because of her age, neither her parents nor the producers explained to her what was actually happening, and so she had no idea what she was auditioning for. When I first auditioned, I thought it was for a pantomime close to where I lived. I didn't know it was a film until about six months in. They did such a good job at hiding it, she said. Adding to the huge distance of going to New Zealand felt like a massive leap. She particularly felt bad when she and her mom said goodbye to her dad before going to set. The Chronicles of Narnia Prince Caspian Video Game The creators of the franchise were also making a video game for each of their films. Therefore, Prince Caspian is based on the novel and movie of the same name. In the game, you can play with one of 20 different characters, including the four Pevensey children. The Chronicles of Narnia The Voyage of the Dawn Treader the final Narnia film coming from Disney premiered in 2010, and ever since, fans of the franchise have been craving more of the story. With Netflix already working on the reboot, the wait is almost over. Now, here's an interesting fact. While filming the franchise, 
Georgie shared a good friendship with William Mosley. As you already know, William played her older brother, Peter. The two of them are still pretty close. And according to an interview Henley did with Cinema Blend, the reason they have this bond is that in her family, she's the youngest. I have two older sisters, I'm the baby. And in Will's family, he's the big brother, the actress explained. They practically grew up together. All those years of acting, premieres, and interviews created this special brother-sister relationship. If you're still wondering what it is like to act when only eight years old, here are more details of Georgie's performance. Always. How? In your world. Perfect Sisters. After appearing in one of the most famous Disney films, Georgie acted in Stanley M. Brooks's directional debut, Perfect Sisters. This is a film with two sisters' protagonists, one a blonde who enjoys popularity, the other is a dark rebel. 16-year-old Sandra and 15-year-old Beth are the perfect sisters. The film is based on Bob Mitchell's 2008 book, The Class Project, How to Kill a Mother. The Sisterhood of Night the same year, Henley played the lead role in the teen drama The Sisterhood of Night. She starred alongside Moonrise Kingdom's Kara Hayward in the film based on Stephen Milosser's short novel. Karen Wachter was the director of the film, which also stars Little Miss Sunshine actress Abigail Breslin. There were definitely rumors about The Sisterhood. <laughs> Access All Areas one of the most recent films by Henley is Access All Areas, in which she plays Natalie. The film follows the story of Heath and Mia, who steals his moped and goes on a road trip with her friends Leon and Nat. They go to a magical musical festival, and once they get there, the drama begins. This is practically a coming-out-of-age story that includes festivals and friendship. I've put you a gig. You're a good musician. And anyway, I heard your unfriendly girlfriend. The Spanish Princess. This miniseries is the last film Henley appeared in. She plays the role of Meg Tudor, and apparently, when she portrayed this character, she was the same age as Queen Lucy at the end of The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. With Netflix currently working on the Narnia reboot, we can't help but hope for the actress's appearance in at least a scene. But maybe she'll make a cameo. Who knows? How would I? I'm very glad to see you. And I you, Your Grace. Have you been sleeping in On a related note, what is your favorite role of hers? Let us know down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed our video, make sure you subscribe to our channel so you'll never miss any of our videos in the future. As always, thanks for watching.